perform like that? Uh, just doing your jobs, uh, owning your own square feet, uh, making sure you do the things that the coaches, you know, tell us what to do, and um, you got to make plays at the end of the day. That's that's the difference between winning and losing games. And I think the other team made more plays than we did. Sean said he, he you know, he thought Bo competed, sort of kept in the game. I guess what did you just? I know you're focusing on your own job too, but what did you just make of, of, of his performance and, and the offense overall? Uh, that resiliency, you know, that leadership that he always, um, you know. Um, showcases every time he steps onto the field. So, you know, I give a lot of credit to him. It's, it's big shoes for him to fill, but I feel like, you know, he's learning, he's he's getting better every single time, and we're going to continue to trust him every single week. What do you feel like you learned from this first game? Um, just understanding the tempo of the game, little tendencies and nuances here, reading the defense, little things like that, just um, being more uh, savvy with the way you play. So I, I think that was good exposure for the first game. How the tempo compared to preseason and uh, training camp? So? I mean, it was about the same. Obviously, guys are a little bit better. You know, you're running with the ones, so um, you get different looks. They're bringing in the whole playbook, so um, it, it's good exposure to get you to um, try to learn quickly and try to find your place on this team. How, how, I guess how, how strange is it to kind of have that many catches, but maybe not as you know as many yards as you would have liked? Because that's got to be close to a, a rookie debut record in game one. Uh, I mean, like I'm, I'm not too worried about stats. I'm just trying to contribute where I can, help the team win. Um, if that means I get 10 catches or zero catches, it doesn't matter. At the end of the day, I got to do my job and just make sure I contribute. I mean, the run game pops everything off, you know. So, uh, you know, I just. We just gotta execute, man. You know they played a little bit harder than us today, and uh, you know uh, took a little bit long for us to to finally come back and, and get things going. What are your emotions like after this first game? I mean, I hate losing. You know, so I mean, that's just it. It is what it is. I mean, I right, damn. It's tough, man. Yeah. You know, you always want to come out, especially with a rookie quarterback, and be able to get that first win and, and, and his confidence up. And so uh, we weren't able to do that today. And you know, we'll, we'll come back and clean it up. Is there any specific moment, thing during the game that bothers you the most after today? I'm um, just losing, you know, never a good thing. What Wish are some of the things you felt you needed to do today to help out a rookie quarterback? Make plays, mm -hmm. you know, and uh, I think the first half, you know, it, it was lack of making plays, you know, and the uh, second half, it took a little bit long to be able to get going. And so, uh, you know, just couldn't. Couldn't come back in enough time. Josh, what do you think of how Bo battled and kind of gave you guys a chance there at the end? Just what do you think? I love that, man. You know, a quarterback that that continues to fight. You know, and, and I mean, with our team, man, we just could continue to fight. So, uh, you know, I, it looks good. Um, you know, just just got to clean up stuff, man. You know, and, and, and continue to execute plays. What was his demeanor like in the huddle as when you guys were continuing to fight back? Like he's ready to, to make a play, like we all were. You know, we all we all wanted to make a play for him, and and, and you can tell he wanted to make a play for us. So um, as long as we keep doing that, and I think uh, I think they'll start falling our way. You've been around him for a few months now. I mean, have any doubts about him bouncing back after an outing like this, or, or, or having that confidence going forward? No, I got no doubts, man. I know I know what kind of character he's got and uh, what kind of guy he is. And, uh, you know, we're gonna we're gonna come out next week and uh, fire on all cylinders. Spark that you guys had for this team in the first half. A couple big plays. You had the interceptions. You had the mm -hmm. sacks. Got safety. Yeah, that's how we look and always start the game off. Um, always creating create momentum for us. Um, obviously, getting off to a good start. You know, and just feeding the energy towards the team. I think we've done that. But the main goal for us is just to finish um, those crucial downs where we need to get off the field. I think we could be better at. But you know, overall, we could correct those and. Like I said, we got a long season ahead. Um, you know, we learn from this um, game, you know, just move forward. Second half, not as successful defensively as the first half. Is any of that to do with the fact you guys were out there so much? No, nah, not necessarily. When we go out there, we always expect to do our job, no matter what the situation is. Um, you know, we got to hold ourselves accountable at the end of the day. I mean, nobody else is playing out there for us, but, you know, we got to execute the calls and execute the scheme and uh, play to the best of our ability. So. Um, yeah, we just got to finish all four quarters of the game, all four phases. So that's the main thing. Pat, I know it was such an emphasis for you guys this offseason to start fast, start fast. How mm -hmm. frustrating is it to lose the first game of the season for you? We know, uh, you know, we always want to win every game we can in the NFL. Obviously, this one was a very big game, but, you know, we don't dwell on this, you know what I mean, because it's the first game of the season. Like I said, we got a long road ahead, a long season ahead. So 
Um, I'm very confident in this team. I think we've got a very great team, and we're looking forward to build off it. What are the things you are going to need to build on? Um, like I said, just finishing uh, close games like this. Um, like I said, we had plenty of opportunities to do so. Uh, you know, we just made some mistakes down the line that we could easily correct. But like I said, this honestly, this even though we lost, I feel like it was a great teaching point for us because there were some goods and some bads, you know, some highs and lows. But at the end of the day, we know uh, what type of team we is, and this is a special team to me for real. Pat, Pat what do you think of your personal performance? I know they tested you a bit early there. How did you feel you did today? Um, pretty solid job. Um, there's things I can still correct, but um, you know, I think I held my own at the end of the day. Um, like I said, uh, whenever the opportunities come, you know, I always want to make sure I capitalize and make plays. You know, so um, certain things like I'm going to film room. You know, I'm a very hard critic of myself. So um, you know, certain plays out there, I feel like I left out there, um, but, you know, I just keep on working, keep getting better.